welcome back to Dandelion. It's been snowing for the last few days, but it's finally became sunny. Looking out from a world covered in snow, I thought of doing the laundry, like I do every day. <laughs> hmm, do I have any detergent left? What are you up to? I'm thinking about doing the laundry. Again? <laughs> That's all you do at home! <laughs> Just leave all the housework to the rabbit. He had always complained that Jihei is a stuck-up no- or a stuck-up good-for-nothing aristocrat rabbit. But it finally seemed to have acknowledged Jihei's ability to cook and do housework. You're always busy. You don't have time to clean the house or do the laundry. That's all we do at home, bro! We do the laundry, and we take baths, and we draw, that's it. That's all we do with our time. It's okay. Those are things I need to take care of as an independent adult. Housework, schoolwork, taking care of myself. I have to do everything on my own. Knock something over. There we go. Because <clears throat> I'm an adult now. You always try to be perfect at everything. Because if I don't, I'll fall behind other people. Says who? Jeez, you stopped in his tracks. Who? This is something that I've heard from my mom since I was little. If I don't work hard, I'll fall behind my friends. And then I have to be the first at everything. You know, I told you this before, but don't try to be too perfect at everything. Housework can be put off for a day or two, and you can even skip classes once in a while. Do you really have to live life on a fixed schedule? I don't understand what Jisoo is saying. How can I do that? If I do, I'll get behind other people. Who cares if you get a little behind? Who cares? It's amazing how we can just say those words so casually. I was never told that before. You're so smart and cute already. Why is there a need for you to become even more perfect? Oh, my blood rushing to my face. What did he just say? You're already an amazing girl. Is that not enough? An amazing girl. I never heard that from anyone before. I was just too embarrassed. Mostly because he meant it. Why are you so shy? Of course I'm shy. How can he say those embarrassing statements just so casually? An amazing girl. Cute. Smart. I feel like my head is going to explode. Are you alright? Uh, no. I'm not alright. I'm embarrassed. Your face is really red. It's not really. Don't. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is don't try to be the best at everything. You're already attractive enough as you are. Stop. Attractive? I've never used those words to describe me before. I feel more embarrassed than happy that I don't know what to do. Food giver. Yeah? She just responds so casually. You, you're totally embarrassed. This is really cute, you know? I said stop. 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 This is too much for me to handle all at once. Man, you're really cute. I don't know how to respond. I'm happy, but I'm just too embarrassed to say anything. Cute? Attractive? I'm just not familiar with those words. Look how red you are. <laughs> You're really adorable. Jisoo chuckled. I think he's having fun seeing my reaction. Just felt a bit annoyed that I couldn't think of a good comeback. Well, the day's over. <laughs> Nothing special is. Yeah. Back to doing laundry, I guess. Or right, we should draw more. Our art skill is lacking. What is at the desk? Jisoo's necklace, for some reason. Oh, our beauty is down. Our beauty. Is this help our beauty? Uh, beauty greatly. Pressure mock slightly. Okay, so that's not bad. I think that's our beauty. Hack. Uh, pressure's getting up there, isn't it? Pressure. <laughs> we can do some. We can do some school work. I thought New Year's something would happen, but I guess it's just January 4th now, so... Oh, okay. <clears throat> hey, I'm curious about something. I had a break for the first time in a long time. Jisoo, who was watching me make tea, opened his mouth. Yes? Oh, we got it. Uh, Harlequin, study art, watch a soap opera. Yes. When did you start living alone? I lived alone since I entered college, so it's already been... Since four years. Wow, time flies. It's already been four years. Huh. Four years. Yeah, why? 
So you've lived dangerously alone for four years. Why is he saying those things again? Jisoo looked at me with slight suspicion. How many guys did you go out with while you were living alone? This motherfucker. Why do you suddenly ask? How many guys I went out with? It's a little embarrassing because it's too little. It's my privacy. I don't have to answer him. That's right. Tell him. Why do you want to know? I mean, don't tell him, but like, tell him how you really feel. Tell him he's being too pushy. Why do you want him to know? This is not worth talking about. So you did have guys. Jisoo would definitely be jealous of my past. I could see his eyes burning with determination to find out. What about you? You probably dated a lot of girls. Me. Jisoo's necklace. Jian commented last time that he might have gotten it from an ex-girlfriend. That necklace. Why are you always wearing it? Is it from a special someone? Jisoo suddenly became quiet. Oh, this isn't a good sign. Was it really from a girl? Did you get it from a girl? Jisoo nodded slightly. Ooh. Really? So it was from an ex-girlfriend, or I got this necklace from my little sister. Sister? Oh, Jisoo had a sister. I felt myself relax. Would have been hurt if he said he had gotten the necklace from someone he had loved. Why would you have been hurt? That doesn't matter. You literally was just like, I've done so many men in my past. You had a little sister. I've been envious. I was the only child and always wanted a little sister since I was a little kid. What's her name? How old is she? Lily. She's 12. That's a pretty name. She would have been a student here if she was 12. What is she doing now? She's mostly at home. Oh, she must be with her parents every day. I can see that Jesus' face became stiff. Did I say something wrong? You said parents. Maybe their parents have passed away and they're living with their relatives. I regretted questioning him without thinking. I also didn't want to hear questions that related to my parents. I'm sorry, you really don't have to answer. They're both gone. Jisoo said flatly. And then he turned his eyes away from me. Only the two of us lived together since four years ago. Four years ago? The timing is so specific. That's funny. I thought it was fine to talk about this now. It's been four years already, but it still feels a bit strange. I could hear the water boiling in the kettle. I turned off the stove and stood there for a while. I felt a weird stir in my heart. It was as if it was no big deal, but I felt that he was still grieving over it. I just knew that it was pretending to be okay. You hide your feelings inside, thinking that it'll hurt less when time passes, but when you later have to face it, you can't bear it. It's like me. I think I know how you feel. I have to confront it. Although your hands might shake uncontrollably and that you feel that your old wound is getting pricked again, my parents are actually divorced. When they got divorced, they asked me whom I wanted to live with. I didn't understand. I wanted all of us to be together. So I asked them why we had to live separately. And mom said that she wouldn't be able to keep her sanity if she continued to live with dad. I didn't see, I, want, I didn't want to see mom having a hard time, so I decided to live with her. But as soon as I did, I felt like I lost both my parents. Mom changed drastically after the divorce. After my parents got divorced, the bright and happy family was nowhere to be found. I would make sure to prep meals with food that would help me concentrate better when studying. She would call me as soon as cram school finishes at 2 a.m., making sure that I did come straight home after to review what I had learned, and my confidence began to fade away. It's strange. If someone asks, I try to answer as if nothing is wrong, but then I realize that I'm not. So sometimes I lie that my family's really happy and that it hurts afterwards. I'm still reminded of the time when I was young, when I could do nothing but watch my family fall apart. I couldn't do anything because I was young. Because it was a matter between adults, and I had to helplessly watch my family fall apart. To become that gentle and obedient child that Mom wanted. Uh, oh, sorry. Ah! <laughs> It sounded euphoric. I felt a sudden warmth. Jisoo's arms were embracing me. We're trembling a bit. Why is Jisoo trembling? You're a warm person, yet strong. Huh? So glad to have met someone like you. Jisoo's words warmed my heart up. I never imagined that someone would say these words to me. I always had low self-esteem. I was busy blaming myself when things went wrong. But there is someone who says he's glad to have me. I'm so glad that you chose me. For the first time, I was glad that I became independent from Mom. Because if I hadn't, I would not have changed. And I wouldn't have turned into a strong 
person, as Jesus said. I don't want to let you go. Ever. Jesus' words deeply touched my heart. Nah, the day's over. <laughs> Alright. Well, it's just like that, I guess.